now most of businesses cannot afford the expensive spaces to set up a whole structure how do you do that in collaboration with others is how is what notify is trying to take a look at so let me leave you with that uh, interview and then i'll be taking a look at your comments across social media platforms and then i'll, I'll be right back this is still be a tuesday with me Richard okay. open your online <laughs> supermarket and then now what happens is that once you get a customer you just uh, tell us and then we do the delivery for them so notified logistics have been supporting businesses that do not have the ability to set up their own physical outlets since 2018 they have a program that has supported more than 10,000 businesses how are they doing that and how has that brought them to become a leading growth accelerator let's get to it i'm sitting down with one of the co-founders helen Nerito. she's going to help me understand what program they've done and what they have in store for the future for the entrepreneurs in the country yeah asante sana for joining us karibu sana notify yes yeah so before maybe we begin a little introduction to yourself okay and how you came about to start notify to all right up to what it is right now yeah my name is Helen, Helen Nyambura Wawero. Uh, we started Notify about five years ago. Uh, basically, I was an online business. We were selling moisturizers. So we imported the moisturizers, but then I could not afford a whole shop for myself. So I, op I opened a Facebook page and I was also selling them on, on Instagram. Uh, and of course, when you start uh, marketing, you get leads. So we could organize with these leads to meet in town. So customers would tell me, can we, you know, can I get to see the product? Can I get to interact with the product and would uh, organize a meeting to meet in town? But then, of course, I didn't have a physical place where I would uh, have that meeting. And so we had to meet in the street or in a restaurant. And what that meant is that I, you know, I was using fare to yeah, come. Exactly. So I have to use fare to come. I have to maybe wait for them in a restaurant and I eat, you know, I eat something. And that means that all the profit that I was getting from the product that I was selling yeah, was going, you know, and, and sometimes this customer would come and they'd even say, eh, I'll come, you know, I'll buy next time. And um, that's when we started noticing that now there's a big challenge because um, the, we are wasting a lot of money and we are also wasting a lot of time to have to, you know, meet with these people outside a shop. And of course, I could not afford a whole shop. So we thought of talking to a friend to give us a small space in her shop. And she did that. So we brought all the moisturizers now from the house to, to town. Yes. And now every time I, I got an inquiry about somebody who wanted to see the product or interact with the product, I just direct them to that shop. And from then, my problems were solved. My sales now were going up. I didn't have to uh, incur a lot of costs to come and also to waste a lot of time coming. And I didn't want, I mean, I also didn't have to annoy a client maybe when I'm stuck in traffic jam and all that. So now they just come when they get to town, they just go directly to the shop and they would be attended to. And because of that simple solution of getting a small space in a friend's shop, my sales started growing. and. Uh, uh, my business was, I mean, my customers were happier, I was happy, and that's what every business needs. And at that point is when we decided uh, we are going to invite other online shops and online businesses. Uh, we cost share uh, the costs of running a shop because, I mean, the costs of running a shop are, are very many. Yeah, because, yeah, in the CBD, I mean, if we start talking about goodwill, I mean, it's crazy. Um, if you and, and these are just, goodwill, first of all, is usually non-refundable. Then you'll have to pay deposits. Then you pay rent. You have not partitioned that shop, mm -hmm. you know, and you have not bought your stock. So imagine if you are a young person and you're a small business, where on, you know, where do you get all that money? Right. And you've not even marketed, and marketing is another story altogether. Yes. So that's why we decided let's come together, uh, cost share all these costs. So if there's goodwill to be paid or if, it's, if there's deposit to be paid, we cost share, mm -hmm. and then it isn't the burden, the burden for everybody. Yeah. So that's how we started, and in a month 
month's time we had about 15 actually 12 12 so businesses to get no now I moved from my friend's shop and I, I, I got a small shop it was very small mm -hmm. but from that small shop we had 12 businesses that we were you know working right. together running together but now the beauty about it is even because all of us were marketing our businesses online imagine the kind of traffic that we were getting from each other because mm -hmm. now me I was selling moisturizers somebody else was selling home decor another person was selling bags so everybody was yes because we were all targeting the same customers so that's the same customer who's coming to buy moisturizers would buy your bag and would buy a sticker for for their home so we were really benefiting from each other and at that point is when we knew there's a business case here so we now moved from the small shop to a bigger shop and um, five years on we are now I mean we've supported thousands of businesses and now we are running malls we are no longer in the small shops now we are doing malls again the, with the same concept but now we've made it even better whereby now customers are free to go around and see other people's products at ease yeah, it's a really yeah. Nice place here. thank you and, um, I'm seeing a lot of showcase thank you of yeah here. do you have several other malls like this one too? yes Where are they? so we have two main malls in Nairobi we have this one which is the main one this one has three floors it's along my avenue if you know where MKU University is if you're just opposite if you look you'll see notify mall a very big signage that you cannot miss so we you can't yes <laughs> oh yeah 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 so we we have notify uh, along my avenue we have notify mall along Tomboya Street and we have notify mall along my avenue in Mombasa yeah. So here and Mombasa. Yes. Really yes. And how is the operation looking like when you're here and there's another mall elsewhere? Uh, it's it's actually amazing um, because we are an ecosystem and then we also have a system to manage all the branches. And uh, these are not the only branches that we have plans to open uh, malls everywhere because it's solving a very very big problem. Yeah. How is the how is the decision um, during the onboarding process looking like? The onboarding. The onboarding process is very simple. Uh, we enter into a contract, so you need to. We will share the contract with you. You go through it. If you're okay with the terms and conditions, you just sign the contract, pay up, and then you come and stock with us. So after that, now you can even update your information on your page and tell people if you want to see my products, just go to Notify Mall. So we co-own the space so you actually say my location is notify mall so other than the space that you offer to this and yeah the mm. what other services i'm um, understanding this probably marketing yeah what else is there? yeah so as you've seen, I'm sure you've witnessed that we have a lot of working clients who walk in and out of the malls. So we do a lot of um, cross-selling. So if somebody was coming to pick, say like for example, a top, we will show them a trouser or a skirt or a bag or makeup product and we have all kinds of products. So we normally do a lot, a lot of cross-selling for our customers. Apart from that, we are doing a free next day delivery. If your order uh, is above 2,000, so if you're selling online and you get an order that is above 2,000, we are uh, doing free next day delivery for your customers. And this is basically to just encourage your customers to shop more from you. Exactly, because again, delivery services are very expensive and most of the customers are usually put down by the delivery cost. So if you're buying something like, for example, for 500, and then I tell you that the delivery cost is 250, it doesn't even make sense, you know? Right. Yeah, so we want uh, customers to buy from you and so we do free next day delivery but we also want them to spend more so that's why we've capped it at 2000. Alright, yeah. so now let's get to the accelerator program yes. that you launched. Yes. What was the decision behind that? So the accelerator program that you're talking about is called the Notify Entrepreneurs Program. Uh, we are very grateful to God because we've been funded to be able to support 20,000 businesses wow. for the next one year. Yeah, so basically what we're doing about the Entrepreneurs Program is you come, you register with us, then you have access to any of our malls for free for the next one year. So you pay just a registration fee of 20,000 and then you bring your products, um, you, 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 you'll have access to this to the space for the whole year without worrying about monthly rent. Right. Yeah, but apart from that, we are also um, onboarding our vendors, our vendors are our customers, the people who stock here, uh, and bringing in people who would be interested to sell their products without necessarily owning uh, the stock. How, how does that look like? 
Yeah, it's it's actually amazing because we are creating jobs for people. So if you just have, uh, if you don't have the stock, you can sell the stock that we have here at a commission. Yes, at a commission. So we have. Um, suppliers we have wholesalers and manufacturers the likes of ramptons are part of the, our supplier program we have unilever we have luminac and we have our other vendors like uh, nursing mama who have their products in our in our platform so all you do when you sign up for the notify entrepreneurs program is uh, we give you the catalogs and the photos so you can open an online supermarket and sell products without necessarily owning them all you have to do is look for a client yes so you just need maybe a facebook page or an instagram page or share them on whatsapp then once you get an order you notify us and we do the delivery for you right imagine really on point out yes there in, yes uh, notify Yes. They notify you once they get a client. Exactly. So basically it was inspired by the pandemic. So the program is a um, post-pandemic recovery program. We, we, I mean, businesses were really affected by, by the pandemic, even as we were, we were affected. Yeah. So the inspiration behind it is just to help businesses to recover from the effects of the pandemic. Right. Yeah. So you have this here. And yes. you also have the other mall that you just said is in uh, Mombasa. Yes. Is the acceleration, is the program happening on both sides, on both ends? All our malls. So you can choose either this one along Way Avenue or Tomboya Street or Mombasa. Or you can have two because there are some people um, who have a lot of products and they would want to target people in Nairobi and also people in, in Mombasa. So if you want two, you can pay for two. Or if you want all the three, you can pay for the three. Right. So yeah. I'm understanding for all this to happen, you yeah. need uh, experienced partners for yeah. and also people who have already been there in the field who have uh, um, experience. How have you decided to choose your partners? What informs the decision? Yeah, so we we have very interesting partners in, in like for example, our employees are very, very um, experienced and also they, you know, like our customer service is top notch. So we normally hire the best. Uh, we also partner with um, vendors who are selling legit products and quality products. So we usually are very careful with who it is that we onboard so that we don't sell you know products that are just exactly yeah. that get customers i mean customer complaints from everywhere mm -hmm. yeah so we are very very particular on the people that we on board how do you measure progress of the businesses that you already have uh, so how we measure prog progress for them is that we are the ones who receive all their, we, we have all their data. So in terms of their sales, in terms of their deliveries and all that, we have all that data because we are the ones who handle their deliveries, we handle their sales on a daily basis. So we are able to advise even a business, this is what your customer is saying, can you try and maybe uh, try this other product or adjust the price a bit and and we, I mean we are very involved with these businesses and we are there for them uh, as we one of the other things that you're getting if you join the notify entrepreneurs program is a whole free 10 weeks prog uh, training program on different aspects of business including social media marketing which I mean it's it's, it's the a very important yeah aspect. it's the heart of the business and if you're not um, doing social media uh, marketing then you're not in business so we are training them on how to do social media marketing we are training them on funding and um, we I, as I mentioned we've been funded so we we train them on how to structure funding, also how to look for funding on how to look for funding and we also have a pool of these people who say you know we have a bit of money which business can we work with and which business can we support so we help them to structure funding and other aspects of a business so a whole training for 10 weeks on different aspects of a business when you were beginning back then, yes. five years, yes. five years ago, did yes. you imagine, did you know, <laughs> that you will get to this place that you are Never. Like? I never even imagined. I'll tell you, I, I am a Christian and I love God so much. And the thing that God says in his word is that the things that you've never even imagined or even dreamt about, those are the things that I've put in store for you. And our journey has been a journey of faith. So we, 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 we really listen to what the Lord is saying and what God wants to do and we follow his instructions and this is what he has done for us we wanted to run a beauty business we wanted to sell moisturizers you just know moisturizers. just moisturizers but him he had this in mind mm -hmm. yeah so right. yeah so we never imagined <laughs> we thank god what are some of the bottlenecks yes. that you had to 
um, face in terms yeah. of the, the licensing, the yeah. space, uh, mm. operations, all these businesses. Yeah. What are some of those challenges you've had to go through? I think one of our greatest challenge um, has been funding. Um, Getting funding on this side of, of the world is is not easy. It's very, it's, it's very difficult. And and also, I mean we're in Kenya and Kenyans <laughs> Kenyans always doubt, you know. They always doubt the they, they, they doubt the concept, they doubt all that. So Pioneer, if you are a pioneer, and we are the pioneers, I mean, we we sat down and came up with this concept of rent a shelf, and and people are doubting. But those who are not doubting, they have really benefited. Actually, most of it, actually, uh, almost ninety percent of the twelve businesses that I started with now have their own shops. Like you know, shops. They outgrew the the the, the, so nice. the shelves. But now we I mean they we keep consulting with them and doing business with them. Like now for example with the supplier program that I'm telling you about, they most of them are now on boarding to become suppliers so that now the people who are who are reselling can resell their products. So relationships Very yes important. You created them and I'm sure you've cemented them. Yes. Looking into the future yes. do you think you are going to change in this space? The future is definitely very bright. We are looking forward to what um, God is going to do for, for us, but we want to open as many branches as possible. Um, what we've realized is that this, I mean, everybody is asking, when are you going to come to Kisumu? When are you going to come to uh, Eldoret? And, and we have a, a pick-up point in Eldoret, but we want to go to every town. And we also want to now introduce this concept even outside Kenya. Yeah, so that's how the future looks like. Very affordable. Mm. Last one, something I didn't uh, remember to ask is, how much does it cost to rent a shelf? So, um, as you've seen, the, the mall is, is uh, categorized, so it depends with the category that you're in. So if you're selling bags, you just come with your bags and you put them where the section for bags is. So it's like a supermarket, but for small businesses. So we don't, uh, we, we, we charge 20,000 per year. For, months yes, for 12 months full, you pay one off and you don't have to worry about monthly rent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so 20,000 per year. It's quite affordable. Yeah, so it's the accelerator program. It's ending on the 17th of, um, of September. Mm -hmm. So if people can be able to take advantage of it and register, mm -hmm. it will be of great benefit to you and, and, and to other people. And you said where can they do this registration? Uh, so we are, uh, you can visit any of our branches as I mentioned. We are along Moy Avenue, IBA building. We are along Tomboya Street Notify Mall and we are in Mombasa along Moy Avenue, opposite Shell in, al, al, around the Mapemeni area. So you can visit any of our branches and you'll be assisted. My final word would be if you ever had a dream or a business idea don't be afraid just start and then when you do that partner with people who will help you to cut cost at the end of the day marketing is the most important aspect of your business so invest in marketing and that's why we are supporting you we are giving you a whole year to do biashara without worrying about monthly rent so that you can reinvest the money that you'd otherwise pay for for rent to marketing yeah so you can find us on instagram we are notify logistics we are also notify logistics on on facebook and uh, you can also check our website which is www.notify.co.ke all right yeah thank you very much Helen. anytime and we're hoping that they can notify you yes so that, uh, you can <laughs> be able to inspire more business growth in the country. great great karibu sana notify all right Okay, all right, that was Notify. We had a very interesting discussion there. If you've been watching and you're an entrepreneur, they have they have an ex accelerator program that you should probably, you should assuredly, like for sure, for sure, please make sure that you tune into that uh, accelerator program. But also they have space for you. If you want to work in the CBD, you can go bring your products there. They rent a shelf for you for 20,000 bob a year. A year, a whole year, you don't have to think about rent. And they do you uh, product shoots 
they do your marketing they do your data analytics for you for just 20000 bob also something interesting you should note that is notify have um, a program for you if you are someone who's trying to make money but doesn't you don't have products or you don't have goods to sell you can sell what they have in their store from your house for commission so you can check out what kind of products they have market them get someone to go and buy them you won't even have to be there physically once they do a purchase you get yourself a commission isn't that amazing 